Hi Scorpio, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for December for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're just going to see whatever comes up. This is for the entire month of December, whenever it resonates. If it doesn't resonate now, come back and check at the end of the month, because it's for the whole month. Um, this isn't a private reading. It may not even be for you, but you won't know until the end of the month, okay? So this is for Scorpio. We're just going to see what comes up. I focus on love. I'm not accepting private readings at this time. Um, Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to hear? We need to start from here. Oh, you could, you're probably getting some attention, Scorpio. You probably are. People are probably looking up to you or admiring you. That's for darn sure. You're being admired. You could be being admired by an Aries Leo Sagittarius. But this is, you're being admire, admired for your hard work, right? This is, this is the, this is the king of, um, well, the king of, he has a lot of patience, he has a lot of strength, he has a lot of courage, he has a lot of ambition. So if you're not dealing with this person, that's you taking on these energies. Confidence. Look at how strong you are. You've got a lot of strength, Scorpio, and it shows. Perseverance as well. You're looking really hot, too. So you're looking really good. Oh, you may have had to walk away from something recently, or maybe you need to leave something behind. I don't know what this is. Eight of Cups. I mean, something is being left behind. Climbing that ladder, right? You have to walk away from something to get to the top. So that's probably what you've had to do, right? Ooh, so that you, this is a welcome offer of love. A welcome message of love. This is also playfulness. This is flirtation. So you may be feeling really playful at this time. Or somebody could be, you know, flirting with you. They, they are very, I mean, you're very attractive at this time. So you would probably do have somebody crushing on you or you're crushing on them. That's for damn sure. So um, there's a lot of um, passion shining through, okay? People can see that you're very passionate at this time. It's like you're probably omitting uh, pheromones or something like that. What if Whatever. You're just um, vibrating very highly, put it that way. Just waiting for the, for the time to be ripe to pick. And the time is just about ripe to pick. See, the baskets are empty. She hasn't picked them yet. But it looks like they're they're ripe to their fullest of potential. So it's about time to pick. You know, it's time to uh, harvest. It's almost harvest time. <laughs> oh my goodness, it is almost harvest time. But anyway, we're going to get this down here a little bit. I told you. I told you. We have a new partner here. This is a new sexual partner. And there's just like an instant instant spark. It's like, like I said, hot. Very hot. So there's a lot of... Uh, <sighs> listen to me. Get it? <sighs> that kind of thing. Okay, this is like, wow. This fire is too hot. It's just like, wow. Instant. Instant. Son of a bitch. Okay. So, yeah. I mean, this is unbelievable. So, there's somebody crushing on you. And they probably want to have sex with you. Or you guys are having sex. Or something like that. Okay. And it's passionate. It's like, I can't stay away. It's like, it's just like, um... <laughs> There's no need to, to uh, hide it, you know what I mean? It's, the time is absolutely ripe. It is definitely harvest time. There's no doubt about it. Okay, so somebody, it's like, look at this. He's like, woo! He's like, I got it! 
I got it. I got it. I got it. It's like I, you're on top of the world, put it that way. And whoever you're dealing with sees you as that. They are very, very attracted to you and the, it's on. It's on. The fire has been lit. And it's not just like it's been lit. It's like somebody poured some gas on it. Okay. Um, wow. Wow. So major new beginning here. Major. Something big. Very big. And it's very exciting. It's very passionate. It has room for a lot of growth. It can just get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. It probably is getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Just saying. Anyway, um, and this is probably you with a with a boatload of love ready to go, right? You're just like, yeah, I'm on fire, but my, this is this is real shit, you know? It's like I'm really, this is about my heart and I have really good intentions. Yeah, the, intract, the attraction is, is there and I am like blown away by this, but I really have intentions on falling in love with this person and this person probably has intentions in falling in love with you okay there's really good intentions here from both parties oh i'm trying to contain myself and you're gonna have to contain yourself i'm like trying to contain myself and i'm telling you what you're gonna have to contain yourself because this is, there's so much passion here. There's so much sexual attraction that you may not be able to contain yourself. So I'm here to just say, you know, have fun. But anyway, let me um, zoom this in. Yeah, so this is like, and everybody says this is one night stand. It's not always one night stand, especially with these two cards right next to it. There's passion, love, passion, love. All the ingredients that you need. For a beautiful, beautiful, <laughs> exciting relationship. So whatever is going on here, it involves attraction, passion, and love. And, there's an, and it is super exciting. And it leads to a whole new chapter. Okay, one phase of your life is over. The phase of waiting. Waiting for that harvest. Victory! Victory! Oh yeah, oh yeah, we got some victory here. And there ain't no doubt about it, we got some victory here. And it's growing, and it's probably... <laughs> I'm trying to keep it clean, but it's not easy. And you ain't gonna probably keep it clean either. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah. Look at this shit. I mean, there's so much passion here. There's so much fire. There's so much uh, <laughs> magnetism, okay, chemistry, that keeping it under control is going to be very, 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 very hard. So, yeah. And that's right in the middle. You got a new partnership. You have a new partner, and it is like, woo, it's up. Put it that way. It's up. Um, and there's there's probably some sort... It's happening fast. So fast that you probably didn't think it was going to happen like this. It was like all of a sudden this attraction happened and you it just blows your mind. It blows your mind. So be prepared to have your mind blown. If it hasn't been already... Mind blowing. Ooh! Come on now. I'm trying to keep it under control. They're naked, okay? This is a unexpected. It happened unexpectedly, right? This unexpected attraction. This, you didn't expect this to happen. This person, person may not be your usual type, but oh my God. The connection is real. Real. Really real. It's like, this is undeniable. It's a soulmate. It is. The end of despair. Seriously, the end of being alone, the end of sadness, it's over. It's a four of swords. Reverse. Thank God it's reverse. We want it reverse. The 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 emptiness that you have feel it been feeling inside, waiting for this, waiting and waiting and waiting. Done. Over. I'm not even I'm just gonna go ahead and get the uh Angel Romance cards because this is clear cut. 
you have somebody that is coming into your life if they haven't come already that is going to light that fire so bright that you are going to be it's going to be hard for you to keep your pants on okay so that's what i got to tell you let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others well i don't know how that plays a part but maybe you need to ask them how to keep it under control <laughs> how to slow down or something because this is moving really fast i don't know maybe you need to get some advice from them as you know how you don't want to lose this situation how can i keep this under control because i'm about ready to burst so you know ask for and accept support from others is whatever you got to do to keep it you know whoo, on, on the low down which i don't think you're going to be able to keep it on the low down because there's so much uh, what are those pheromones, like I said, the attraction, it's just animal attraction. It's like, mm, let me have them. So that's what I see. Oh, release your ex. It's time to clear your energy. If you have not done so already, the time is now. And that would make sense with a lover's card because that's usually, this is usually choosing between two. If your ex has been holding you back, no. No more, because this is the partner of a lifetime. It really is. Or this is the, uh, <laughs> I don't know if it's of a lifetime. It doesn't, I mean, I don't know if it's from of a lifetime, but this is a attraction that is undeniable. That can, I mean, this is a new beginning here. That could lead to something long term. And this is a card of victory and success. And this is a card of victory and success. But this is a completion of one cycle with your ex. The world is... The world is a completion, major completion with your ex. Done. Goodbye. I found it. I found victory. I mean, this is so good. I mean, it's just like the fire within you has been relit to a point where there ain't no stopping you now. And God forbid this person that's on the other side, they're probably like, their fire's lit too. So whatever, wear some protection or something. Um, yeah, so yeah, there, there's passion and love. There's passion and love here. So it's not just sex, it's both. And it's, it's, you're not probably going to have your clothes on very much, put it that way. I don't see a lot of clothes on, seriously. No. Very sexual month. Good luck. <laughs>